I have a very special review about sandalwood fragrances. I want to make uh, a review about 11 samples that I have. First of all, I have Tam Dao from Deep Teak. This one. From <music> Tam Dao is a Deep Teak fragrance. Deep Teak is a well-known well house from France. And this is a very easygoing fragrance. I think it's for women and men from 15 to 100 years old. It's the most easy sandalwood that I know. It's also the most simple one and uh, if you want to save fragrance sandalwood take this one. Then next one I have Creed Original Sandal. A really man's fragrance I think. To me it's for men from 25 years and up. It's rich, it's fruity, floral and um, it's a little bit more hazy and uh, yeah it is beautiful to me and I think it's delicious so for 25 and up for men it's just my idea you know okay then we have another one it is uh, from Flores a really English sandalwood Flores sandal <laughs> Flores Santal, I can see wearing young men, people from let's say 20 till 40 years old. It's a little bit, it's fresh, it's simple, but it has a little bit animalic thing in it. For, yeah, let's say, for young people, it's, it's like beautiful on a male, maybe also on a female, but to me on a male. And I can see this wearing... Uh, the children of Prince Charles at this moment at their age that's what I think about it typically English beautiful so that's what I think okay then we go to a really female sandalwood fragrance to me for 35 years and up 30 35 it's beautiful Etro Etra it's uh, Italian house <laughs> Yeah, it's a really house that makes beautiful floral fragrances and here you have a combination of florals and sandalwood to my opinion. It's very mature, it's very beautiful for let's say ladies 30, 35. And that's what I think about Etro Etra. And before you're 30, 35 and you're looking for a sandalwood fragrance, I would recommend um, by Killian. Les ondes dangereux. Because I think that uh, that fragrance is uh, really fitting woman in their age. Yeah, when they're a little bit younger and then go to Etro Etra. First try uh, by Killian. And it's a really fresh, female, light, beautiful, watery fragrance that has sandalwood. But yeah, try it. I have a sample here. Then I also have uh, another one that uh, is um, also very good on ladies, I think. But if you want a really complex fragrance, then you would choose this one. It's a little bit less mainstream. It is a little bit more complex, rich and full. I think it's a new fragrance. It's from Serge Lutens. It is Santal Majuscule. It's this one. And uh, yeah, I can see wearing ladies this from 25 and up. And it is complex, rich and full. Try it. Then I have a really, really special one, a really feminine kind of uh, sandalwood because it has some rose in it. It's like a rose sandalwood combination to me. And I can see wearing, let's say, men who have a very feminine side and also 
really kind of let's say elegant but also a little bit stiff but also beautiful and um, also very a little bit feminine man or with a feminine side this is um, from Il Profumo Santo Rouge that's what I think you should try this one it is a rose sandalwood fragrance then I have a green fresh bitter sandalwood that I really like it's to me the most complex the most beautiful one from uh, uh, Lorenzo Fioresi from Florence it is um, yeah it's a very beautiful one and um, I have it here on a card from Celeste from The Hague it is a fresh green bitter fragrance to me for ladies for let's say 25 and up it can be easy worn by men as well of course but to me it's really a beautiful the most interesting fragrance from sandalwood for women the Filoresi Santo or Sandalo this name in Italian from Sandalwood Sandalo and try it then I have a really let's say a quantic a little bit citrus citrus maybe lychee or lychee kind of smell really fresh and beautiful yeah, let's say uh, for uh, everyone let's say 18 years and up um, it's the most uh, let's say most fresh kind of fragrance that I think can be worn by everyone it's Trumper sandalwood <music> Trumper sandalwood very beautiful and uh, very fresh very fruity kind of bergamot uh, lemon kind of sandalwood and then I have sandal 33 that I already reviewed and uh, yeah I have the oil here yeah to me this is the most beautiful sandalwood to me this is really sandalwood I mean all the others kind of uh, use sandalwood and have something with sandalwood inside but uh, to me this is the real sandalwood the one and only sandalwood fragrance that I consider as the real thing but all the others are very beautiful and they use sandalwood you could say they have sandalwood of course they have sandalwood but to me this is the most um, yeah, dry sandalwood I like the Australian sandalwood I see sandalwood 33 on everyone between yeah, let's say 30, 40 and up that's what I think and then I have the last one this one from Chanel it's actually also a sandalwood fragrance <laughs> It's the biggest bottle I have, comparison to the others. 200 ml. Yeah, it's typically Chanel. This sandalwood, what do you? It's exclusive, and uh, you cannot compare this uh, with the other fragrances because um, yeah, Chanel is something totally different. I mean, all the others have some refined thing in it in terms of. Uh, yeah, let's say complexity and uh, uh, natural scents and things in it and uh, you know Chanel is something on itself uh, Chanel is the fragrance that uh, uses uh, this typically let's say artificial aldehydes or aldehyde and uh, that's the tradition of Chanel you know Chanel is all the heats or aldehydes it's just what it is and it it uh, dates back from um, 19 let's say 19 uh, 1915 1920 19 uh, yeah 1920 this one is 1926 and 
yeah, it, it comes from uh, from the Russian perfume maker Ernest Bo from uh, from Russia, who worked uh, la later for uh, for the French, and his grand grand grandparents came from uh, from France. So let's say this is Chanel number no. five, the Russian French combination with uh, a very very modern modern kind of making fragrances way which is all the heights beautiful it's the light scent of sandalwood in a very modern suit and uh, you cannot compare this to anything but i would say this is a unisex fragrance for 18 years and up and uh, you can wear this uh, always very easy so that's what i think about the sandal fragrances um, very strange maybe, but uh, that's my opinion. Thanks for watching, I'll see you next time.